Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sam. If you are new, welcome. I'm so happy that you're here. For today's video, as you guys can see by the title down there, we're doing my everyday look during quarantine, if I need to go outside. It's just a makeup look that I have been doing. It's really quick, and usually it takes me about half an hour to look this put together. I usually do this look if I'm going to go with my in-laws or with my family. But usually when I go like grocery shopping, um, I usually don't wear makeup because I'm still going to be wearing my mask. So... Yeah, that's the world that we live in right now. I hope you guys are staying safe, and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Before we get started, please don't forget to subscribe in the little button down there. And if you want to know how I got this look, then just keep on watching. So I already have um, moisturizer on, and I'm just going to start off by applying a little bit of primer. And this is my e.l.f. Putty Primer. And I wanted to film this because I don't, I, I don't know about you, but I hardly wear any makeup now. Um... Unless I'm like filming, um, although it's not like it's okay if you don't wear makeup. Whenever I put on makeup, it makes me feel a little bit better. Also, like I know that we wear like masks, you know, whenever we go outside and stuff, which you should. But yeah, we should be wearing mask out masks outside whenever we are, you know, in contact with other people and stuff. At least here in San Diego, um, it is like mandatory to wear mask outside i'm gonna start off by kind of like outlining my brows and then i'll move on to the rest of my face yeah i wanted to kind of also film this and kind of like check in with you guys and see how you guys are holding up during like quarantine or how is it um where you live a lot of things started closing down again um they closed down gyms um i believe dine-ins dine-in restaurants as well um because our cases or actually like san diego was in the governor's like watch list for cases so yeah they closed down the gyms i believe starting on tuesday it was like that day he went live and then he's like starting today and i even received uh email from the gym that i used to go to and they were like, oh, we're going to close down like today at 8.30 p.m. I actually used um, the NYX Born to Glow um, foundation. I'm going to be using that today. I actually did a first impression, so I'll be linking it up here. I'm going to just dot a little bit. And I'm not going to actually put a lot of foundation today. That's how I've been like, if I know that I'm going to be going outside... Um, I don't put a lot of foundation. I try to just set it um, with powder. And then I'm going to go ahead and use my Tarte um, Shape Tape Concealer and my Anastasia Contour Stick in the shade Fawn. I'm super excited because I have the ColourPop Foundation coming in. I, have, I was able to get the Pure... Um, and Raw Beauty Christie palette, which I'm so excited. Although, um, I, I don't know, I was a little bit kind of like, mm, I don't want to say disappointed, but kind of sad because everybody was like, oh my god, this is such a cool concept, the whole like double-sided palette. And I don't know if you guys know, but like I love Shanik So. She's like one of my favorite YouTubers ever. And she actually came out with a palette with BH Cosmetics. Which was the same concept, the double sided palette. And everybody's like, oh my god, that's such a cool concept. And I'm like, do you guys not remember that collab? <laughs> I love Rob Beauty Christie, but like, she didn't, even, she didn't invent the double sided palette. I mean, I'm not saying she did, but everybody's kind of like giving her credit for it. And I'm like, but my babe Shanik still did that. Like, I'm gonna take my um, Kylie Cosmetics um, setting powder, and then I'm gonna take my Mac Cosmetics Studio Fix powder. I'm gonna go in with my Hula bronzer.
I'm going to play a little bit on my temples. Um, I'm like really excited too because I'm going to reorganize <laughs> my pantry and I actually need to start looking on Amazon. I already looked a little bit um, on like organizing like the pantry and stuff. We live in an apartment so we don't have like a bunch of like um like storage i mean we do have a, a lot of cabinets and right now it's a little bit of a mess so i, I like really want to organize that i'm going to look into like storage things on amazon and i might film it <laughs> because it will be a whole um what's it called it would be an entire like transformation of how to like as how my pantry looks right now I'm just combining these two samples I have here this is um, love flush in love hangover by Tarte and then this is party by sorry this is Too Faced and then this is um, Tarte so I'm literally just combining both of them but yeah we've been um, we've been looking at like pantry organization on Pinterest and stuff I'm just applying a little bit more of the concealer onto my lids because it was a little patchy and I'm just gonna take um, a vanilla shade bl um, blush a vanilla shade shadow just to set that so what have you guys been up to during this quarantine have you guys been cleaning, organizing? This week was not like a good week for me. It was more on the lacy side. I was just, you know, sometimes you have like off days. Oh, I feel, I feel like this whole week was like an off week for me. This keeps coming down. It's so annoying. So now the, that that car stopped going off, I'm going to take my highlight. And this is... um. Wet n Wild Hello Halo and the shade, this is in the shade Met Someone and I'm actually just going to take um, this one right here because this one is too peachy but this gold one, look at that, it's super blinding. Okay, so I'm going to take a little bit of this Freck um, product and this is um, to like create, I'm going to this is to create like um, like fall freckles. You just put a little bit and then take your finger and kind of like spread that around. And I know that ColourPop just came out with a very similar product, but actually theirs is like a pen, which I'm excited to try out actually. I think I'm gonna order that. So I've been watching um, Criminal Minds because I'm obsessed and I've been obsessed since I was like 10. Um, and I'm on the last season and I am so sad. I'm probably going to start re-watching it again because come on, to be honest, I do that with so many shows. I think I've watched The Vampire Diaries like four times already. Friends like 10. Like, literally, like, from start to finish. It's just something I do. I'm going to go on to my eyes, and I'm going to take um, from the Mimosa BH Cosmetics Palette. I actually did a full face of makeup, and I'm going to link it up here. And I'm going to take the shade We Love Brunch, which is this really nice neutral shade right here. And I'm going to take that and put that all over my crease. This has a little bit of a like peachy like undertone and right now like filming it's probably going to take me about an hour to film this but this look literally takes me like 30 minutes from start to finish. It's just super simple just so that I look a little bit like put together. I'm going to take a more fluffy brush um, just so that I can blend this more on my crease
and then I'm gonna actually do like a little bit of a wing liner with some eyeshadow I'm gonna take this angle brush now and I'm gonna take the shade happy hour which is this one right here and I'm gonna place that right I'm gonna place this really close to my lash line actually well I'm just gonna put it right now but I wanted a more true brown and this is more of a orangey I'm gonna take another angle brush this chocolate brown color here and I'm gonna it's more like a true brown and I'm gonna apply that just on top of that brown liner and I'm gonna flick it a little bit and I'm just taking that fluffy brush that I was using to like blend that I'm gonna take my favorite lashes currently, and these are the Black, um, Ardell Black 113s. And I'm gonna actually prep these so that the glue gets tacky while I do my eyebrows. I put a little bit of mascara. I'm um, using the uh, Maybelline Defalsies Lash Lift. Again, I did a video on this mascara, and I'll link it right here. For my inner corner, I'm going to take this um, overshadow sex pot in the shade No Money No Honey by The Balm. And it is the most beautiful highlight. I'm just going to apply this in my inner corner and it just gives you such a beautiful glow. And I'm going to apply a little bit on my nose. I'm going to apply a little bit of Mascara to blend the falsies with my natural lashes. And then for my lip combo, I have been obsessed with these. You guys know that I you guys know that I used to not love uh, lining my lips, but ever since I bought these, like oh my god. This is the um, Line Crime Velveteens and this is in the shade Angel. This is sorry not sorry from Too Faced. This is the lipstick I wore on my wedding, and it is the most perfect shade. And I haven't been able to find a similar color. And I'm actually going to wear my hair in a bun because it's been like really, really hot outside. So that's it for today's makeup look. I really hope you guys enjoyed. I am in love with this makeup look. Like I said, this usually just takes me like half an hour um, if I want to do like a super quick look, but still like look put together. The products that I use in this video are going to be linked down in the description box as well as all of my social media. And until then, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!